What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at again with another video. So, we're gonna check out Botchamania episode 465. This should be another good one. We're gonna start off the year with a Botchamania uh video, so I'm looking forward to this. You guys have been amazing showing all the love and support last year, so we're gonna continue that trend going forward in 2023. And I am still your undisputed YouTube wrestling champ of the world. Let's get right into this Botchamania episode. This is Jeffrey Bot. Are you watching Botchamania? Really, bro? One, referee, two, three. Really? He took time to say that. He lose the He took time to say that, y'all. Danger zone. Rest in peace. Rest in peace. What is Top Dollar thinking? I already don't like it. Oh, bro, there this spot. No way. You gotta be me. I guess there's a reason he doesn't do that often. Take that one back to the lab, but somehow dropping the rest of the <laughs> Dog, they even buried it themselves on commentary. They just oh, take that back to the lab, but somehow he dropped everybody. Come on, bro. I'm not quite sure how Top Dollar is actually still standing. He came over the top rope and landed hard. <laughs> Real retro. Oh, damn. Wait, did they push him back over? Oh, no. Next day, Rush tweeted uh, tweeted uh, the Cody meme. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Whoa. Oh no, it's not catching on fire. Oh no. Oh no. 
No. Oh, that just kills the spot because he's just standing there like this being held up. It wasn't catching on fire. That's cheap ass lighter, Floyd. Oh. They said, nah, we want fire. Wow, that's just, that's so depressing. Like, that's legit depressing. Jeez. That's cold. Hey, can you stop cursing, please? They're okay. <laughs> Let's make this special. <laughs> you a big motherfucker. That's that's AEW for you. <laughs> hey, could you tone down on the cursing? We got you, we got you. Rick Ross, come on there. Just throws out the MFs. <laughs> Rick Ross here to mediate. <laughs> Big motherfucker. <laughs> Every time I'd like to conclude our tour, and I mean it, y'all have been one of the greatest groups I have ever worked with, really. <laughs> okay, are there any questions? Yes. Where's the basement? Excuse me? Aren't we going to see the basement? <laughs> There's no basement at the Alamo. <laughs> <laughs> Love that song. I believe they figure if they can work together to take out the more experienced fallen flower, then they can go at it one on one. But we know those teams never work out. There's too many egos involved. And Way the fallen many. flower is the great equalizer in this match. That's right. The enemy of my enemy is my friend looks good on paper. Wow. But in reality, your friend's still going to stab you in the back. Well, I hope you don't stab me in the back. That's, that's oh, cool. Friends now? Oh, man. That's cool. Work colleagues at best, Larry. True. <laughs> of course, they were talking too much. <laughs> Shout out to Matthew on Botchamania. With, with an F. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. That was pretty cool, man. Taz! It's Taz! Here we go. We got a little uh, action uh, coming up next here. We always have action. It's dog, for God's sakes. What are you talking about, Taz? But, uh, what? <laughs> regardless, the factory in action. Huh. A lot of action. What? And Marshall and company. What am I? Ba -ba -na 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 the following contest is a true match. Oh, they can't. Taz, that, that match, match of breed that you were They doing, can't was, care on dark, bro. Dog. It was headed straight <laughs> into the side of a mountain. <laughs> But you uh, if I had it out bro, the last possible two more, second. If I had two more seconds, I would have sunk. I promise you, I was done. <laughs> they I do not care on dark, bro. <laughs> what is disappointing for me is the <laughs> cartoon. That was me 50 pounds ago. Those pounds are gone, man. <laughs> oh, what the, the Christmas tree? What? The Christmas tree is nailed down, dude. <laughs> I like what they did <laughs> now. <laughs> they added him with a little muscular uh, muscular body. <laughs> wise, you gotta watch where gonna let the tree just fell in half. It's one of those gimmicks that's uh, in trees. That's the problem. It's not the old tree. You're saying, you're saying it's not an actual tree. It's probably. not a real tree. It's oh, okay. a fake tree. It's like you, Tony. Yeah, I got a limp biscuit. Uh, uh, sorry, <laughs> I, I usually come apart when you pull on. Exactly. The hell. <laughs> Taz is, he'd be having all kinds of fun on commentary. If you want to show off your WWE pride every time you pay, visit ultimatewwecard.com to see if you pre-qualify now. Terms apply. Kevin, did you forget to arrange Bailey's ringside chair? This is, a, this is a freaking role model. She was almost number one contender, and you didn't even bother. No, no, I'll, I'm the gentleman here. Sit down. I'm sorry. Please. No, no, she doesn't want to talk to you. I'll get, the, I'll get the technical things worked out here. You just call the action. I'll do both. Candice LeRae one-on-one -on -one with EO Sky. Candice obviously looking for a bit of revenge, having been taken out of action. No one helps you. Bailey, that she couldn't even 
hold her child. Oh, Bailey doesn't even have a headset yet, Kevin. No, I'm just... <laughs> what is this? Kevin, Bailey would like you to shut up permanently. <laughs> I'm gonna, you know what, I'm gonna see, I'm gonna get this worked out. I don't have my degree in whatever I'm supposed to to be a technical wizard, but our sound guy ain't doing our job, so I'll take care of it. It's all right. Wow. But the heads have refused to <laughs> Judging by the expression on her face, oh. Bailey was somewhat impressed. There is absolutely no <laughs> way. You got Where did you learn to fly? What's going on here? Is that the wrong person? Now, one thing that I definitely have to talk about as I toss my sunglasses to the ground. Kofi Kingston is racking up accolades like crazy, you know. He has now set the record for the man with the most tag team no, title no, reigns in the country <laughs> at 15 reigns. That's not true. That's not true. I got 16. That's not true. I did some research. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wow. He said, no, no, no. That's not true. That's not true. I did my research. <laughs> I fucking love Booker T. <laughs> well, even if you count in WCW and WWE reigns, I don't know how he got 16. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything because I didn't want Booker to get any more assaulted than he'd already been. <laughs> oh. Yes, I am. You lost your mind. No. <laughs> you lost your balls. Love. I just think you've lost your balls. Game over! Face of the undefeated TNT champion. If he I see it. In, day see the references. Grace to your village was the most important day of your life. But for me, it was Tuesday. From the first day that I graced your promotion, it was the greatest day of your promotions in life. But for me, wow, it was Tuesday. That's <laughs> crazy. I think Brian should go home, be a family man, <laughs> wow. raggedy bitch. Uh, Trey Edison is up Wow, next. they he definitely said, uh, reference uh, a lot of that movie. Holy. I read your tweet regarding the Bound for Glory 2007 bat incident with Sting. What did you two say to each other in the ring? Also, backstage, what was said. Thank you very much. Sting was supposed to stop the bat. He didn't have his hands together. They were apart, so the bat went right down between his hands and hit him right on the oh. head, and his head exploded. Blood was shooting everywhere. Oh. He had to get 20 stitches in his head. Damn. And I was like, fudge. <laughs> like, oh my God, <laughs> uh, I thought I knocked him out. I mean, Damn. His head, it, it, it had a loud clunk. Clunk, like it was Dude. really loud. And the fans, even in the crowd, were like, holy crap. And uh, I didn't know <laughs> what to do. And Sting actually grabbed the bat, didn't break character. Wow. And, uh, hit me in the gut with it or whatever he did. And he finished it off. But um, we went backstage and Sting wasn't even mad. He's like, hey, it was my fault. I should have had my hands together. It wasn't your fault. Sting is like, is he like the Lord? I mean, he's like, yeah. some wow, wow. That shout out to Sting for being just real chill about it. I mean, I mean, he did kind of mess up and not catch it at the right time. But the fact he got clocked in the face with a bat, busted open, stayed in character and didn't really trip over it. Testament to just his professionalism, man. Sounds like yeah, Mr. Perfect. Together, you can like hit him in the head perfect. and split his head with a baseball bat. And he's like, Kurt, it's not your fault. It's mine. It's mine. <laughs> that's oh fucking God, awesome. That sounds amazing. That that's fucking awesome, man. Sting is he's goaded, bro. That's so fucking cool. Just be chill like that. 
You there, boy. What's today? What's today, my fine fellow? Today? Well, today is Christmas Day. And you know what that means? <laughs> AEW Dynamite, AEW Rampage, AEW Rampage, AEW Rampage, AEW Rampage, AEW Rampage. Get your sea shined up, grab a stick of doozy. The taste is going to move you. Take a sniff. Oosie right <laughs> fruit. Ah! I love it. <laughs> That's definitely stuff. Classic segment right here. <laughs> what? Mid. Infinity stars? <laughs> mid. Uh, Did it say mid? No way. Did they say mid? What? Mid. Infinity stars? Oh, wow. All right. How do you have these? Oh, we actually got a lot of those. <laughs> Some of the guys use them as paperweights. Oh. Some of them. Wow. It's me. It's DDP. Wow. I like how they did that. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good one. Hold the right Joy-Con with the IR motion camera close to your mouth. Whoa. Now hold that position. Three, two, one. Go! Y'all is stupid, bro. Bro. That's it. Oh my god. That's funny, bro. Hey everybody, Brian Daniels in here, and I am so excited because AEW is finally coming! <laughs> now is the time. Awaken my masters! So much pain right now, the two of us. Oh, oh, okay, that was real. Oh, that big, that big rigs segment is a prime candidate for a botchamania ending. Hmm. Hey, kids, strap yourself in for some action packed racing. It's big rigs, 18 wheels of thunder, and we got trucks. Yeah, <laughs> trucks. Big rigs. Never lose a race again. You're always winner. With big rigs. Engines equipped with quantum phasing molecular mechanics to pass through solid objects so as not to interrupt the racing experience. Nothing stands in your way when you're big rigs. Rear spinning tires with warp drive velocity for interdimensional exploring. Leave the game behind and exceed the boundaries of existence. Watching, big motherfucking rigs. <laughs> Driving around in fucking trucks. Big motherfucking rigs. <laughs> big rigs. Rigs. Big, big rigs. Big rigs. Big motherfucking <laughs> rigs. That was great. 
That was great. <laughs> oh my God, really? The Bray Wyatt stuff? <laughs> the Uncle Howdy? That's, that was a good one. And I got to explain this to people because uh, many of you don't actually watch a lot of WWE, but you watch like WrestleMania or whatever. <laughs> goo, 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 goo. Who gives a fuck? She had goo, goo. Really? That's what I said. You must goo. Your a falling cravat. What? Doing that. You can be anything you want to do. It's totally up to you. Even if you don't know what to do, I can help you, show you. You can be the guy who types so fast on computers. A clackety 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 clack. Or you can be the one who kicks so hard at a football. What the hell? Or you can be the one who bangs the hammer when he's angry. Order. Or you can be the one who makes people better when they're poorly. Oh, careful. Maybe I could be the one who plants a tree. Cuts it down to make a shed. And I will invent a digital currency based around respect. And I would really prefer to do a little. I see the reference they did. <laughs> With, uh, I think he goes by DSP game. The nigga damn near blew all his money on this fucking, I think it was like mobile WWE game. Wait, we gotta, if you know the reference, you know, it's just funny to see they actually put that in there. Make a shirt. And I will invent a digital currency based around respect. I think spent majority of his money on that fucking damn game. And I would really prefer to do as little as possible or nothing at all. <laughs> Is that an option? <laughs> that ending was good, bro. That was good. What? Bro, Tat... Bro, it's, Tash just doesn't care. And that's what makes it fucking hilarious. They just, just let him go out there. Whatever. Fuck it. You're Tash. Oh, this is a great one, man. I love me some Botchamania. I always have uh, since I started checking out uh, the vi uh, his videos or their videos. I'm sure it's probably a collection of people. But I started checking out their videos last year. So I'm going to continue that trend this year. Comment down below. Let me know what was your favorite part from this video. And I am still your undisputed YouTube champion of the world. Appreciate y'all kicking with me. See y'all next one. Peace.